Students in Wayne County are hearing stories of drug addiction and gun violence. Leaders there hope this helps them make better decisions about their future. Our Trey Howard talked to organizers at Ignite You First and a judge on the importance of reaching youth early. Leaders in Wayne County are encouraging teens to make positive decisions that lead to a future away from crime. The Wayne County Youth Court is investing in programs to do just that and on Wednesday invited Ignite You First to the high school to help teach students how to overcome traumas in unfortunate circumstance. A lot of kids live in this fantasy world of social media that's not real and they think that they are not living up to the expectations of the world, which is a lie. Katie Phipps is the strategy director at Ignite You First and she says she was inspired to start the organization because of her troubled upbringing. My mother was a drug addict. My father passed away when I was very young, which because of her lack of coping skills became a drug addict and an alcoholic. So I lived on the streets. I was homeless. Judge Katie Clay says she sees similar stories in the youth in Wayne County. With the number of arrests over the past few years for violent crimes, she hopes Phipps' story makes an impact. And just like many other counties in Mississippi, Wayne County has had its fair share of childhood trauma from drug addiction, not only of children, but of parents and also gun violence. And so she touched on all of these subjects for us and I believe the children were very receptive. Phipps also spent 15 months in prison, wrongfully convicted of murder. After her release, she says it was her choice to use that pain to help others. And it comes down to a personal choice of this happened, I can't change it, I accept that I can't change it, and I'm gonna move forward for the benefit of myself and for the people around me. In Wayne County, Trey Howard, WDAM7, on your side. Leaders say they plan to work with local law enforcement for more youth programs in the future.